What's up, challengers? Welcome to the gym. My name is Gym Leader Geo, and this is episode 32 of our blind Pokemon Sun and Moon Let's Play. We are about to try and take on uh, Acarola's Trial. I'm assuming this is the door, so let's get started. Nope, just a Stungfisk, Puku Muku. Whim. Some books. Bed. That's where the little kids play, I guess. Uh, how about this way? Is this it? Now just more toys and stuff. Oh, and a, uh, a Zygarde cube. Trash can in the past. That would be where we found a bunch of hidden items. So I guess we talked to her. My trial takes place at the abandoned site where the Pokemon used to be. Okay, the supermarket used to be. So I guess we need to... Ah! What do you think you're doing? Stop it. Stop it right now. Yo, for real, girl? Your bag was moving right in front of my eyes. I'm just supposed to ignore that. If you got some rare Pokemon in there, I'm going to have to take it and make some cash. Even if it's not that rare of a Pokemon, I bet I could still get paid, Joe. But I'm about to stop this kid. Oh, so you were following that script, are we? A trainer dashes forward to save the girl, huh? I'm not going to let you be the hero in this scene. He's like gesturing. He's like, mm, yeah. Oh, wait, where's the dance he does before every Pokemon battle? Like, right? Yeah, something like that. Team Skull Grunt got one Pokemon, and it's a Drowsy. Let's finish this. Drowsy defeated. Team Grunt Thug goes down. And now we probably have to talk to Lily for way too long. She kind of bores me, I gotta be honest. I felt like in X and Y, your, your two rivals, or your two friends, had more... I mean, Hao has a lot of personality. Uh, Hao has a lot of personality, but this girl doesn't... Lily's just kind of... I don't know. Go on, you little troublemaker. You better thank Geo, too. Pew! Cosmog. Nebby. When I was out shopping, kept thinking how I wanted to help you during your island challenge, and I saw these. He's going to give us a max potion. Nope, luxury balls. Okay, I'll take that. I bought them without even thinking. <laughs> yeah, you must be from a very privileged family to just throw money like that. I'm going to rest at the Aether House. Oh, Akarola, thank you. I might take you up on that. Okay, Lily, go ahead. Ouch. I just realized my shirt kind of matches... Right above me here, the purple. And do you, Geo, says Acro. Actually, no, guys, look at this shirt. So I got this from the company that I buy my scrubs from. They're called Benefit Medical. And look at this. Right underneath it here, it says, what does it say? It says, when you look better in scrubs than you do in the clubs. Can't help it. That's kind of true, though. <laughs> I wear scrubs all the time. I don't, I don't go out as much as I used to. In my younger days... Oh, oh, my knee and my back. Okay, the next trial is creeping me out a little bit. Are you sure you want to go in there? Oh, I get it, because it's ghost type. And you're freaked out, because it's ghost. Spooky ghost. Acarola, the old supermarket, is right down this way, down on Route 14. Very cool. So we'll go. We'll go, but we won't like it. Where the beach is covered in black sand. Oh, and the water is reflecting just as much. If you look on the, um, oh, is that a trainer battle? Ah, oh, dang. Get caught. Get caught, Geo. Get caught. Caught. Swalt in your coffee. This guy's got two Pokemon. Fast forward now. And unfast forward, man. It's like I got superpowers or something. I just magically make things go <laughs> really fast. You, you, just kidding, guys. But you didn't miss anything there. Um, but <laughs> I got frozen by an Ice Fang by a Gyarados, which is the second Pokemon. So I'm just going to not waste any time. Just quickly undo that bad bit of luck. Freeze. Get out of here. Freeze remains... Just such a frustrating, such a frustrating, I don't think, I don't think anything that completely makes you lose 
infinite turns should exist in this game. Like, you could literally have bad luck and just never, ever, ever, ever get out of freeze. Sleep, at least there's like mandatory and minimum turns, but. Oh, look at this. Good thing I looked at the. Oh, Shadow Ball. That's a really good one, too. Good thing I looked at the, the little Rotom decks there. It's got a little map on it. Uh, is there anything for me to sniff out on this bee? No, looks like no. Uh, let's go battle this trainer. Quickly. Let's quickly battle this trainer. Time is at 7. I gotta hurry. Come on, Keone. <gasps> Puka Muku! Puka Miku goes down. Puka Miku. Uh, was there anything around here that I feel like I should be looking for? A normal fishing spot. Gotta have ripples. There you go. I'll try that out. Cause you never know. I always thought it was just Magikarps all the time. But then I caught that ugly fish in the last episode. Now it's a wishy-washy. Poor little wishy-washy. And keep going in the water here. Looking for items or Pokemon or... Looks like nothing much. Ooh, Zygarde Cube. I'm calling it the wrong thing. It's a creature that gets sucked into the Zygarde Cube, but I don't want to... I don't want to play this game. It doesn't tell me what it is. It's making me pretend like I don't know, but it's called a Zygarde Cube. Here we are. Climb up these steps and my trial begins. What's this man going to do? Old place is actually a trial site. I heard you might be coming. Good luck. Another trainer. Seems like there's a couple of trainers here. Can finish this guy off. What's he got? Two. Two Pokemon. One of them is... Ooh! What is this? Ah! No! Ah! <laughs> Look at this cute little thing! Toge Demaru? So continue I'm assuming it's electric type, it's got that little tail and would make sense to continue in the trend of always having an electric rodent in the in the game. Oh my goodness, it learns magnet rise, so it's definitely at least partially electric. Uh, might be steel type. Iron barbs, okay, yeah. So it's definitely part steel. Uh, which means that I got nothing against it. Let's just uh, growth up. And the second Pokemon was a Gabite. So Gabite goes down, Nips gains some EXP, Golem levels up, and we defeat the Collector. The trial is going to begin right on the other side of, of this gentleman. Uh, there's an item hidden somewhere around here for with which I could find. Got it. Another big pearl. Every sandy beach, I'm telling you. Um, and then we've got... We battled that guy. There's not really anything else going on here. I'm gonna just quickly heal up. Because some, uh, some of my mons are kind of weak. My mons, not my moms, guys. <laughs> Duh. My team is just a ragtag group of misfits at the moment. I guess there's a decent decent coverage in there though. Although I do have I have a bug and a grass type, and just I find that irking. Irksome. So we'll go up here. I saw this little nedge. Nedge? Ledge. And we've got oh my god. Got a murder of crows up here. Crawr! Guys, I just witnessed a murder of crows. <laughs> Bend in sight with the thrifty Mega Mart. Alright, Acarola, show me. Show me. 
The time has finally come, Geo, so I guess I should explain what kind of trial this is, huh? This old building is full of lots of ghost-type Pokemon. Did you know? Do you see? You've got to find the totem Pokemon of this site and snap a shot of it with the Pokefinder? Come on. If you take pictures of other ghost types, it's definitely going to come out to get it on the phone have its po picture taken too. So if you see anything weird happening inside this old place, try to check it out. I bet you'll find a ghost type Pokemon causing mischief. So the fo get the photo before it's gone. I'm going to use the... Hee <laughs> hee. And your Rotom is a ghost type too. We just do this and there. I got special shooting mode just for the trial. You'll only be able to use it this site though. Got it? I don't care. Man, I don't want to do this stupid... Abandoned Mega Mart, which is kind of cool. So we gotta find something weird. Do you see? Can't ride Pokemon in here. The conveyor step belt started moving all by itself. Okay. Yeah, let's fire up the Poke Finder. That's the spirit. Ah, oh, there we go. Got him. Oh no, the Pokemon spotted me. Well, you do not say. I snapped a sweet pick of it, so I would expect it would see me. Maybe a fighting Pokemon with normal and fighting type moves is. Oh, he has pursuit. Okay. Now I can't leave. <gasps> A Pikachu! Chase the Pikachu. Shopping cart started moving all on its own. Boot up the Poke Finder. And look around. Got you, Haunter. We can't catch Pokemon in these trials. It'd be cool to catch a Haunter, because I could just trade it immediately for a Gengar. Okay, Haunter down. Chasing that Pikachu. It's not even a real Pikachu, guys. Honestly. Just keep on going. Around California way. Look, a Pikachu doll. And they're levitating all on its own. Fire up the Poke Finder. Here we go. Ladies and gentle minx. Okay, so what? Just take it of that? Ah, there we go. Gengar. Just waltzing around like it owns the place. Didn't even look at me. What a, what a jokester. Wild Gengar. This thing's gonna be pretty powerful, actually. Hmm. Quite. And Gengar drops, which means the totem Pokemon is likely nearby. You didn't do a thing, but the lock clicked open. How spooky. I can feel a pair of eyes sizing up, and now the Poke Finder booted up all by its all by its little lonesome self. Scanning, take a picture of the Pikachu. Getting warmer. Getting warmer. Aha! Oh my god! <laughs> Look at that little doll. See me? So Pikachu is the main battle in a thing. Wait, this is an actual Pokemon? This is an actual Pokemon! <laughs> this is an actual Pokemon! No! Tell me this is not real! <laughs> you gotta be kidding me! <laughs> it's a me- Mimikyu! Mimikyu! 
Oh my god. Oh, it's like a Pikachu and Mimi Mew. Mimi Mew. Oh my god, I want to catch it so bad, but I know I can't. Uh, so it's a ghost type gym. It's probably a ghost type. McBro is hurt. If I were a nice trainer, I would heal it right now so it doesn't die. So I will. Because I'm a nice trainer, guys, and that's what nice trainers do. Hyper potion. Hyper potion. Oh my word. Uh, get O code me. My god. Okay, so this thing doesn't uh, play around. And I didn't see what stat boosts it got. But it does play rough. So, a. Uh, <laughs> I got nothing here that'll resist that. I want to make it fun. I don't want to just throw in Lil P and, like, finish this man's career. So, I guess. I'm kind of bored of using Nips, though. Bugnitude's fun. Bugnitude's always fun. Learns play rough. Now that could just be great coverage. Oh god, I forgot about the calling the allies. Uh, it's just a haunter. And I've got... What is it? Is it crunch on this guy? Yeah, I got crunch. So we can just take out this haunter. No problem. Mimikyu. Mimikyu. This has got like some... Probably got something for me though. Now I'll just play rough. And he misses that 90% accurate, but go figure the hypnosis hits me. Come on. Oh my god, that's frustrating. I'm about to pop one of these items on myself. But first I gotta I gotta wake up. Chesto will do the trick. If he predicts my item usage and goes for the double... Aha! They're both stupid. Do not put me to sleep again. I will be very frustrated. He's gonna do it. He's gonna go for it. Yeah, anytime I'm, a, I'm awake... Oh my god, that hits so hard. And he lands the hypnosis again. It's 60 accuracy, man. Come on. So I guess I just can't. I just straight up can't with this thing. Um, let's just send in Snorrent to die. This is literally a sacrifice. It's a horrible thing to say, but I'm just sacrificing so I get a free switch in. Because I will not survive a play rough. The reason I'm doing this is I want Lil P in here. I was considering going for the Sing on the Haunter, but probably it makes more sense to just go for the Sparkling Aria. So I will do that. Yeah, it speeds me to go for the Play Rough. It's uh, close to a two-hit KO. If this takes out the Haunter, I might have a chance to hit him with a second. Mimikyu, it's a Disguise. Oh, so it... Its disguise was busted? Or is it, I'm confused. So it doesn't actually look like that? Does it actually look like not a Pikachu? I thought that it was that. I'm so confused. The f it just the first hit doesn't affect it? Is that what it's going for? Whatever. It mimics, what, my sparkling Aria? Good thing I didn't go for Sing on that turn. I was considering it. That's a two-hit KO, but it called its ally. So I'm going to have to take one more play rough. Oh, it's got a Gengar. Gengar might outspeed me if it's high level. If it goes for a play rough here, I could be in trouble. Because it will outspeed me, and two play roughs will kill me. And this is... The Sparkling Aria did as much damage as it did last time, only because... Uh, it was against a single target. This is spread move, so I'm going to lose some of that power. Uh, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Mimikyu goes down anyway. Doubled down. Massive amounts of experience. Bugnitude dings. Golem dings. 
And the totem Pokemon is defeated. Ah, nice. Very cool. Mimikyu disappeared somewhere. I really want that. A picture was added. There's a fuzzy image of a Mimikyu caught in this picture. Mimikyu. Mimikyu. So let's have Acarola tell me how great I am and give me a ghost dinium. Let's see how you did. It's pretty hard to catch it on film, so this is a really great attempt, which means... Oh, let's see the dance, huh? What do you guys think the dance is going to be? I think it's going to be like a... Something like that. Like a surprise. This is definitely going to be like surprise hands. Maybe some jazz fingers in there. Maybe like a sucking on the thumb. That's kind of ghost. Like if you see a ghost, you're like... Mm. What's the dance going to be? There's always a dance whenever you do a, a Z move. Ha! Ooh! I... Rah, I told you! I, man, I was pretty close, actually. I mean, I said it was going to be like, hands out, but she was like, mmm. So here you go. Ten Dusk Balls. So I guess I can go back in there and maybe catch a Mimi Q. That's that. You said Pokemon Finder started up on its own during your trial. Oh, cut it out, Jiri. You're trying to scare me, huh? You'll have to come up with something a bit more believable than that. There's not even any room in the back of that shop for starters. How gullible do you think I am? <sighs> Chicken skin, like a chill going through me for some reason. You're a ghost, Captain. You don't even believe me when I tell you that I saw a ghost? Come on now. Another trial completed. Zzz. Now let's split. Aether House is awaiting. Okay, so it's going to be back to the Aether House then. Uh, I'm going to go back in here and try and find a Mimikyu uh, before I head out. So let's just save the game here and uh, call this an episode. It's going to be a nice little short one today. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. And I will see you guys on the next episode. As always, my name is Jim Leader Geo. You guys the challengers. Thanks for stopping by. I'll see you guys next time.